welcome to Coffee Cast from Roofers Coffee Shop. My name is Heidi Ellsworth, and I am so excited for this next section of this multi segment coffee cast on the tech stack from Owens Corning. Yes, we've been talking technology and we love it. And I'm so excited today to bring Johanna Torkelson from Hover and John Gardner from Owens Corning. John, coming back yes. to talk more about the tech stack and how, what an important part Hover plays in that Owens Corning tech stack. So John, let's start with some introductions. For sure. Can you start us off? Uh, absolutely. Heidi, great to see you. Thanks for all you do for the industry uh, and for our contractors. And Johanna, it's a pleasure to be here with you today. And thanks so much for being such a great partner with Owens Corning. For me, um, I've been in the industry uh, since nine, since 93, dating myself just a touch. Uh, but with all that being said is I've never looked back. Uh, an amazing industry. And I'd I've, I've love to watch it and see where it is actually today. It's just it's mind blowing how advanced and uh, you know developed has become. So with all that said is I've had an opportunity to, to be in the industry for, for many years. And today, uh, with Owens Corning, I head up our learning and development platform. And that is all the resources and tools uh, and training available to our contractors and our network and the industry at large, really to, to help our contractors and industry scale and solve those most difficult problems. And Owens Corning has been leading into uh, this space uh, for quite a few years now, where you know, we, we look at our product portfolio. We love our product portfolio. We know our contractors and homeowners love it. Uh, at the end of the day, our objective is not only to serve up uh, best of quality products uh, that are designed to last with fantastic warranties, but it's that piece of helping our contractors uh, build their business scale, whatever that looks like to them. And we bring a host of resources uh, to our contractors through our network program. And one of them is the tech stack. Um, that we launched last year in conjunction with uh, a few of our business solution partners. And uh, Johanna and Hover are uh, a fantastic example of how we leverage our partners because every single one of them are best in class and serve our contractors um, at the highest level when it comes to that specific technology. And when I think about you know, what uh, you know, Hover has been able to do to transform the industry and how they play in our tech stack, um, it's uh, it's really amazing. And so I love to dig into that a little bit more here today as we get through with you and, and Johanna. So thanks a lot for yeah. allowing me to be here once again and look forward to unpacking this a little bit with you, Heidi. This is great. Mm -hmm. Johanna, welcome to this coffee cast. Please introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about Hover. Yeah, definitely. Well, one, John and Heidi, thank you so much for having me. Really appreciate uh, being able to come together this morning and, and talk a little bit more about what we've been 100%. working on. Um, my name is Johanna Torkelson. I'm a senior manager of channel and business development at Hover. I've been with Hover for about, oh goodness, about four and a half years now, which is wild to think about. Um, and my primary uh, role within the company is really, you know, the bridging that Hover does with Owens Corning and also to other partners within our industry ecosystem. Uh, Hover, uh, in, in its simplest form, you know, we're a web and app based uh, technology where the foundation of our offering is creating exterior measurements and an interactive, customizable 3D model of buildings uh, from either capturing uh, photos within the app or uploading a blueprint to the platform. Um, this way, you know, when, when, when a pro is leveraging Hover, uh, they can be more transparent and more collaborative with their experience with the homeowner um, when they're using that 3D model and the design services that Hover provides. Um, this can help the customer make more competent decisions, uh, so, you know, uh, while we're supporting the contractor and winning more jobs while saving time and money and, um, you know, really building in uh, predictability and consistency into the contractor's workflow and, and really overall business. I love it. And, you know, really, when you're looking at this, that's the customer experience is what Hover brings. I mean, to be able to see their house, to see those measurements, I mean, that that is so important. How do you, um, with this technology and the Owens Corning tech stack, Johanna, how do you see how, how you've been a big part of this and putting it all together? How has this come together and how do you see it all stacking, especially Hover working with all the other technology solutions in that tech stack? Yeah, definitely. So, you know, we're really honored to be partnered with Owens Corning and the adjacent partners of the OC Tech Stack. 
Um, our contribution within the tech stack ecosystem is primarily on the measurement the measurement front. You know, we're providing those exterior measurements down to the nearest inch for your roofing, your walls, your openings, um, in addition to providing that unique, you know, 3D model of the home and the home and the project. Um, we provide additional solutions as well, but when we're talking to the other partners that we're uh, working with within the OC tech staff, we're really supporting there on the on the measurement front. John, how do you <coughs> see Hover and all the other partners kind of fitting together? Yeah. Um, it, it's a great question. That's really where we, you know, that was our our beginning of our journey with the tech stack, um, and it really in backing up before the tech stack. Uh, one of the, you know, one of those special areas that we have with within the network, within our program that serves up resources to our contractors is our business solutions portfolio. And those are our partners that I'm speaking of. <clears throat> and Hover is a great example of that. And as we kind of get a little closer to the tech stack, to your question, you know, when we evaluate all of our business solutions partners and the goal was to create um, and actually serve up to our network members in the industry at large and what best in class looks like um, and how to leverage technologies in the most meaningful ways to, to drive success for each one of our customers and contractors business. And success looks different for every single one of them, depending on where they are in their journey. Yeah. So, you know, the, the, uh, the place to really start with our tech stack um, and the power of it is to look at who we're serving. And that's the North Star, what I call the North Star, which is the homeowner. <clears throat> and throughout the entire stack, tech stack, and the resources and partners that we have built into it, it's always pointed to the consumer, to the homeowner. And so from the very beginning of the tech stack, um, it's all about you know helping to uncover a potential opportunity with, with a customer. And that's the lead gen part of it. And as you work through the tech stack and folks, if you haven't had an opportunity to listen to some of the other recordings that we've done, Heidi, uh, with our other partners yes. with the tech stack, I suggest you do that because it allows you to kind of uncover some more of the details for each one of our partners. But when, it, when we get into the area of where Hover plays very big um, in the stack, uh, it, you know, for me, it really comes down to four really critical elements that you know, serve up the power of what Hover does with the integrations of the tech stack itself. And that is, first of all, you've mentioned it. It's the experience. Um, and mm -hmm. the experience is such an important piece um, and we're talking about the 3D rendering that Hover is able to provide, the details uh, and the ability for the consumer to look at what the focus is in terms of what would potentially be done to the house, the job that we're talking about. But the 3D rendering also allows for that more immersive experience of what else the customer might want to have done on the house. How will that right. roof look on the house? What are the colors associated with the roof and maybe on the outside of the home? You know, when when you're buying anything, the ability to really tap into those, you know, those 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 thought processes and really immerse yourself into the experience. That's that's really important. So that's number one. Number two is the consistency. Uh, the consistency is so important. And I and I kind of parlay that into the the others, the other the third piece, which is the ability to utilize the technology to uh, apply order entry of the materials that you just took the 3D rendering of. So consistency in terms of as a company, <clears throat> I feel really comfortable with the measurements that I'm receiving. I'm able to take that information and convert that into a, a game plan to solve that, that need on, on this particular project. But you know, taking it a step further, what is really cool about the integration of Hover into the tech stack is you know seamlessly being able to take that information that you've just shared with a homeowner that drives the trust and then convert that into a process that's built in to the business that allows for one click. Um, I can then send that order into distribution uh, and allow distributors to take, take that, take the ball from there and run with it. All that without having to draw it on a piece of paper, without having to take time out. It's a fully integrated uh, process in that little sliver of the tech stack is critical and, and very important to yes. make sure that it is consistent and that it allows the next element of the tech stack to take over uh, and drive what that next piece of the consumer experience is going to look like. You know, at, at the end of the day, I mentioned this a couple of times, uh, Johanna, you know this very well, is the integration um, is a critical element of any stack. Uh, and so one of the biggest challenges our contractors face is 
man, there's so many technologies out there. Um, and, and this is such a different, different place than we were even five years ago. It is a, a immersed with technologies and everybody says, I'm the best, I'm the best, I'm the best. Um, and what we do with regard to building out any of our partnerships and particularly with this, with this stack is to really evaluate uh, our partners for what they do and make sure they are best in class. Uh, and, and make sure that this integration is, is incredibly, uh, deep. And the integration, yeah. you know, is the last, the four things that I mentioned. The last one um, is critical because without a solid uh, integration, you're left with a potentially broken stack uh, that is not doing what it's supposed to serve up. So when you think about our our, our tech stack uh, and all of those elements, you know, the last piece that is really focused is this solid integration. Those other elements of Harbor are game changing uh, and they add so yeah. much a power and experience for both the consumer and the, the the backside of the business, which is you know really focusing on cutting costs, saving time, uh, building efficiencies, building consistencies. Uh, you know, you could speak about that to all of our solutions within the stack, but Hover plays big in this part, and that's why they're so critical uh, in the success. To, to our stack and uh, when we unveiled it back in 2023. Yeah, it really is so true. And um, I love that. And that's that's where I wanted Joanna to kind of take that with, and go into this interaction or this integration, sorry, I should say, with Job Nimbus and what you offer. I mean, when you get exact measurements and um, you're able to put that into your process, can you talk to that? Yeah, definitely. So, you know, within the tech stack, we have direct integrations with Job Nimbus, with Company Cam, and then also with Sales Pro. Um, speaking specifically to the Job Nimbus integration, um, the simplest form is that the integration allows for hover measurements to be pushed into uh, Job Nimbus, um, where the pro then can continue the project within the Job Nimbus platform. So, you know, when I'm thinking about the tech stack and the integrations and everything, you know, we're really helping to support everything from the front end from like that lead generation all the way, you know, to post install. Um, and, and it's yeah. a pretty cool uh, uh, stack that that OC has put together with all these partners. You know, as coming from your side and seeing this and now having, you know, it launched in 2023. What are you what are you seeing with contractors and how much this tech stack is helping them and why it's so important to these Owens Corning contractors? Yeah, so we're in a digital age, right? And I feel like our industry as a whole has uh, been more of a slower role to adopt more digital solutions. But now it is uh, we're, we're in a time where like you have to, right? You know, you order your groceries off of line, um, you know, you're doing all your shopping offline. Like this is now a time to really be bringing in digital into your workflow um, so that you're able to scale so that you're yeah. able to be more efficient. Right. Yeah. So the OC tech stack really provides like this all in one solution um, and, an, an, and, an, excuse me, and an integrated workflow um, and hover in the tech stack resources offer a safer solution for their contractors, not having to go up on the roof as much, you know, a contractor and a homeowner, um, you know, can be on the same page with cost, with design, with visualization, uh, with material choices. What color OC shingle do I want to be putting on my roof? Do I want to have a designer shingle, right? Leveraging Hover to be able to make those decisions and the other partners within the OC tech stack um, is, is really powerful when you apply it. Um, you know, and and in addition, you know, you're able to lessen the material waste on site and overall really just yes. providing like this more elevated experience to the homeowner, to the north, to the North Star. Yeah, so you know. to, 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 to summing it, you know, to, to sum it all up, you know, overall, the OC tech stack really supports the pro to be more efficient within their business. And um, I said it once already, but really from the beginning stages of, you know, lead generation, pulling in more business into, into your company, and then being able to support every step of the way so that you're really able to be extremely efficient, provide the most um, elevated experience, interactive experience for your homeowner all the way into installing to make sure that your, your margins are consistent and are tight and you're not sending back material and, uh, you know, under ordering over 
overordering all of those things. So this tech stack really supports that, um, you know, those those goals and creating a really well-rounded um, experience for a contractor to be able to scale it and be more efficient. I love it. I love it. John, the, yes. the hover part of the tech stack, the overall tech stack and the integration, bring us home a little bit because I just love how this all goes together. Yeah, yeah. And uh, so the... The, for me, uh, uh, you know, we've had an opportunity to talk uh, at length with each one of our partners within the stack, Heidi, and this has been a, an amazing journey. Uh, and, you know, for, for those that are listening to this and say, you know, I'd love to learn a little bit more, uh, then I suggest that you you uh, go to uh, owenscorning.com uh, and go into our uh, resources available under the contractor section, and uh, you'll have at your disposal um, a uh, whole plethora uh, and of uh, resources to dive into and dig into the, the tech stack um, and answer many of the questions you might have uh, in your head. But two is all of our ASMs across the United States are well prepared and, and ready to have conversations with you with regard uh, to this tech stack and how it might help you uh, in your process of just uncovering opportunities or you're ready to make some decisions on the technology itself. Um, all that being said um, is, you know, I, I talked about this a little bit on the front end here, Heidi uh, and Johanna, uh, which is, you know, at the end of the day, you know, the, the similarities, Johanna, as you're kind of having conversations about this and as I am too, one of the, you know, the, the areas that we're both talking about is helping our contractors um, <clears throat> to, you know, drive success for their businesses. Uh, and, you know, that's what the, the stack is all about and many of the resources that we bring to bear. One of the things, <clears throat> Heidi and Johanna, that um, I was uh, reading up on recently is from the Small Business Association. Um, and uh, they had a top 10 list of real reasons why small businesses, in this case, roofing contractors, could potentially have, you know, reached their demise with regard to uh, not being able to stay in the business. You know, there's some hard there's some some real information out there where uh, it's sharing with us that you know running a small business and being in the roofing space and within the small business uh you know fold is not easy uh and no. so many you know the cards are stacked up against contractors from the day that they decide that they want to get into it and this is where we are focusing our efforts uh with regard to helping our contractors this is real stuff uh that um, I encourage every one of our contractors, folks listening on to this, to, to dive into. Those top 10 that I, that I just referenced, none of them were about, you know, product and things. It was all about my cash flow. Uh, it was all about uh, not embracing technology. Uh, it, was, uh, it was all about, you know, these, these critical business elements that can really get the most of us uh, if we don't have the technology in, in part to help to drive success in the business. And so this is the area that I love us all to kind of focus on with regard to why do we do this anyway? Um, it's to showcase the fact that, you know, there are best in class companies out there and that this is a great resource to learn from. But two is, you know, as I mentioned, our business solutions partners, they are the best of the best in the industry. Uh, and we have uh, business solutions partners that um, help to, uh, to focus on various elements in all aspects of the business, depending on what's most important or critical for our contractors. This, this tech stack is uh, really taking it to the next level, Heidi and Johanna, as you know, with regard to let's take, uh, you know, the best of the best, create a technology solution that's integrated that allows for the experience of that North Star homeowner to be just perfect. Um, and. Uh, so, yeah, I would suggest learn a little bit more. Talk to your ASM. Talk to Johanna um, and yes. or jump on uh, ownscorning.com and go into our contractor section. We have videos uh, and we have much more of an exploded explanation of what these services and, and resources and the, and the integrations really stand for. So love this. Um, you know, we're bringing it home here with Johanna. Uh, and, you know, all the integrations uh, that we have. And Heidi, I can't thank you enough for uh, the opportunity to, you know, once again, you know, share some of these resources uh, that uh, we bring to bear in a real way to, to do the best that we can to help our contractors scale and solve those biggest of challenges. 
I love it. I love it. Thank you, John. Thank you, Johanna, so mm-hmm. much for sharing your wisdom and share, being a part of this a great tech stack um, that is helping so many contractors. Um, I want to say to everyone out there, please watch the entire Owens Corning Tech Stack Coffee Cast. It's a playlist. You can watch all the different segments, and we will be bringing a full recap of all of the technologies visiting with John and Dave to really wrap up how you can use this tech stack in your business. So be sure to watch them all and we will be seeing you on the next segment of the Owens Corning Tech Stack Coffee Cast. See you then.